And look at this. Pala Tarida even has a single chair for us introverts to sit back and do our thing. All thanks be to God. All thanks. Talking about us introverts, man, what more can I say? I'm Chicano, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys Ibiza, some of the best beaches here in Ibiza, but from an introvert's perspective. So you, in case you happen to be here on the island with your extroverted friends, and you uh, need some alone time to go ride, read, uh, meditate, be with God, whatever it may be, and this video is for you, so stay tuned. And here it is for you mugs. This is the introvert spot. All you introverts out there that wanna come find your own little spot here in paradise. That's Cala Conta, that's where the people are at. And usually there's there's a beach here. All this here is beach, but people don't really come over here, even during the summer, because everyone wants to be with the crowd. All the extroverts want to be with the extroverts. And you see where that yellow thing is? That buoy, all that, if you go all this like this, it's all beach. But again, it's pretty uh it's been crazy out here, man. Personally, I think God's angry because this is unusual. A lot of stuff going on in the world right now. We're in the end of times. People don't even know it. That's why I urge you guys to come to Jesus. The time is now. Wars, natural disasters, unusual weather. Hey, it's here. Still in the Calaconta area. Uh, now I'm going to take you guys to another uh, calm, introvert spot. Even this time of year. Uh, fall, but definitely during the winter. It's all you right here, man. Come write some poems get your um, uh, Wits about you, you know some some extrovert or anyone else in life has thrown you off balance Find these types of secluded spots and you'll be uh, back to yourself in no time. So stay tuned for that I'm about to head in there That's it right there I'll take you guys down right now And as you mugs can see it clearly tells you right there this is a nudist beach so that when you go down there um you won't be uh you won't be shocked you won't be surprised so and this is a place there's a there's a walkthrough but this is a place where um you have i mean fully nude so but you do have uh people that uh, aren't naked you know you don't have to be here you don't have to be naked if you're here but just understand that there are naked people and we know that there's actually a little chinguirito that sets up right here a uh, chinguirito is like a little mini bar beach bar and we know the owner from there a dutch woman named tess and so she's pretty cool man if you, you know if you guys like to drink you come out here you get your drink on and all this right here where you see the water all that is uh usually beach the beach will go up to like i said up to the buoys almost but right now it's been crazy 
and this is where the little mini bar is and all this here is where it's all the uh, people hang out and you will see like men here standing like, fully nude like penis generals you know what they're thing all out so um if that type of stuff irks you or bothers you um then you probably don't want to come here but as an introvert like right now this time of year it's perfect nobody's here so And this one's called Cala Escondida, or Escondido, which means hidden, hidden beach or hidden bay. Platja would be a uh, beach. And look at this, guys. If you want to get into uh, the introvert beaches, hey man, you gotta go off the beaten path. We're arriving soon to Cala Codolar, one of my favorite introvert beaches. So stay tuned for that. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Beautiful. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness gracious, this is heavenly. Look at that. Look at this, guys. This is one of my favorite beaches on the entire island. Seclusion. Solitude. Meditative. absolute best place to come and connect with the Lord. Again, Cala Codolar. Now tell me, just how beautiful is this? An introvert's paradise. You can create magic here, masterpieces with this peaceful solitude. And again, um, we've been hit with a brutal windstorm the last week. And all this is the, the result of that. This is what you call Posedonia. Um, and this is dead Posedonia. This is what the what the boats, the boats here in Ibiza, they tear it up. And the natives and uh, locals want to put some type of restriction on tourism. Because during the summer months, uh, tourists from all over Europe come and tear it up, tear up the island. Um, with their boats and all that so how many more summers can it be to take that's the popular question amongst environmentalists and those that care for nature and beauty more than uh partying and uh getting drunk so and usually the beach starts about where that rock is over to that rock so all this here is beach Stay tuned for more. And here's the name of it right there, Cala Codolar. Now we're about to enter another winter beauty beach called Cala Carida. An introvert's paradise. This is the walk. Now during the summer, forget about it. 
you want to come here and uh, create, get your uh, meditation on, forget about it. You want to come, people watch, that's a different story. But in the, the winter or even in the fall, like right now, oh, it's on. You write some good books here, you know, some good blogs. Man, you can get in the zone. Check it out. Cala Tarida. I'm telling y'all, introvert's paradise right here, especially during this time of year. Look at that. Beauty. And look at this. Cala Tarida even has a single chair for us introverts to sit back and do our thing. Thanks be to God. All thanks. you guys enjoyed this video talking about us introverts man what more can i say this is it right here peace and tranquility doesn't get much better than this find your beach find your paradise it all starts with god <laughs>